Okay. Uh, something, something I want to share with the group, Elias, we learned it in Atlanta. No, we didn't go to Atlanta. We did Las Vegas, right? Uh, Bill Pipes. Uh, one of my big takeaways from that that I want to share with everybody is the person that holds you accountable should make you uncomfortable. And th- I think for me, a lot of the account- like accountability groups that I've been in over the years or like with your friends and your buddies and people that you get along with. And the, the thing that he said that really stood out to me was whoever's keeping you accountable, you should like them. You should respect them. You shouldn't like them think they're jerks or assholes, but they should make you uncomfortable. Like you don't want to disappoint them. And so uh, just a little tip, like it should be, it should be taken seriously. And I'll, I'll say for me this month, I'm in an accountability group where I'm paying $300 a month to have a daily check-in with someone that I look up to and I don't want to let down. So um, if you find that your accountability groups aren't actually holding you accountable to what you said earlier, like, oh, let's just eat cookies together. Uh, that's not going to help you. Like if someone's not actually calling you out on your bullshit and coming from a place of wanting to see you grow and wanting to s- watch you get better at your craft, uh, you're going to find yourself spinning your wheels with these accountability groups.